What up, Team Handsome Guy? Ryan here. Welcome to another daily vlog. And I'm staying out front of my house because I like to pace when I talk, but that's neither here nor there. So, anyways, today I got some really, really good advice for you. Something that, oh, so many people just lack, and it, it is so annoying to me, and it frustrates the hell out of me. And so I have a team of people that work for me, and I've handpicked these people. I've hired them. They're awesome. I love them. They do great work, but... They still lack some one thing, which is why I think that they are working for me. They're not working for, you know, themselves. I'm, I don't know. They have certain skills though that I really enjoy. But when it comes to being an entrepreneur, there's one thing that really just separates you from accomplishing your goals and doing big ass shit. And that's the speed and of implementation. The speed at which you take an idea and you just make it fucking happen. Um, when it comes to writing emails, blog posts, videos, like, I mean, like three days ago, I decided to create a vlog and now I've done it three days in a row. That's going to help me grow my YouTube channel. That's going to help me get more people into my funnels. That's going to help me talk to more people, help people dress better and build a bigger following. So I think it's pretty fucking cool. But had I waited for, oh, the proper camera, I'm using an iPod touch. Had I waited for a different lens, a better editing software, whatever, I would have never fucking done it. You just gotta do shit, and that is what separates people that are successful from people that work for people. That is some fucking amazing advice for you today. I hope you take that and that helps you. But that's not all I got for you today. So I am, uh, once again, I'm waiting to do something before I leave my house. Then I'm probably gonna get some lunch. I really wanna hit my, this is my favorite breakfast, bleh, breakfast place, but as of right now, it's 12.22. I'm still waiting on one of my people to send me something. And I don't think I'm going to be able to get there by 1 o'clock. So that is going to force me to go eat lunch somewhere. So I don't know where yet. But after that, I'm going to most likely go to either the mall or my favorite bike shop, which carries vans, and see if they have any skate highs because they're having a huge sale. It's JNR Bicycles. Um, they're a huge local bike shop. I, when I was at Pro BMX, I used to buy all my stuff there. But they have a lot of vans and they're doing a big like yearly sale right now, today and tomorrow. So I'm gonna try to get up there, um, unless something comes up, I don't know. Try to get up there to uh, check some shit out, see if they have van skate highs. Cause I love van skate highs, I'm wearing them right now. Van skate highs, my favorite, um, just chill shoes. I'm gonna see if they have them at a discount because I wanna answer a question that is on the burning desire of so many people in the YouTube comments. And that is how I lace my van skate highs. It's actually the same way I lace all my shoes. So I'm gonna do a little video on that in this vlog and you'll see that. So on that, I'm gonna grab a cigar later cause it's Friday and I wanna celebrate the week. And big announcement, if you have not signed up for the Handsome Guy Experience and you're interested in going to that, it will. I'm closing registration tonight at midnight. So there's only a few tickets left. If you hit the order button, um, through the Facebook group and the pin post or the emails that you're gonna get from me today and the order cart does not show that means that there are no seats available and you cannot come so sorry about your luck on that um, let's get on the rest of my day peace what up I'm back from the mall and as you can see I have purchased a brand new pair of camel suede skate highs. Now, I've been wanting a pair of camel suede Chelsea boots for a while. Um, just haven't really found ones I liked. And these, I actually kind of like better than the suede Chelsea boots because they're a little different. So, but to answer the burning question on YouTube about how I lace my van skate highs. And pretty much, this is how I lace all of my shoes, okay? So, um, I have gone and done it I've already laced up this skate high, the other shoe, to that matching pair right there. But here's what I do, okay? So I lace my shoes just like normal, like literally just like normal, all the way up until like the last two holes or the last hole. And what I do is I will, usually with the skate highs, you have to do this when it's on the foot, but for the sake of this video, I'm gonna show you here now. You just, you go through the second to last hole, you leave them kind of loose, you know, through here. All right, so now it's just laced up normal. So you still have a little too much on each side. So these are gonna drag on the ground and that'll look like shit. So instead of going to the top, I take this point and I go back through 
this hole. Sometimes it goes easy, sometimes it goes hard. It's a lot easier when it's on your foot. So when that happens, see, torches, it makes this a little tighter, okay? So now it actually, so now that I've gone through there, now it actually stays tight on your foot while only having a little bit hanging out. That is how I lace my skate highs. So they look like this. If you see my video, I'll link to the video I did where I showed you how to wear a skate. My skate highs always look like that. I really like this way. It's simple, it's easy, and I do this with all of my shoes because I honestly hate tying them. Sometimes it gets a little weird and they're a little too long or they're a little too short and you gotta get creative and kind of maybe loop it back through um, you know, the same hole. And sometimes you can put it through the same hole like three or four, like two or three times if you only want your laces, like let's say here, you just keep going through that same hole. It's gonna get tighter and tighter and tighter and make it so your foot doesn't fall off your foot. So that's how I lace my skate highs. I hope you guys, you know, I hope that clears it up for you because I feel like you guys should have been able to figure that out, but whatever, I'm there, I'm here to help you. So yeah, I'm um, getting ready to head up to the cigar bar. You guys can come with me. Um, my boy Chris is coming over here and I think we're, we're going to buy a TV with him. I don't know, but um, I'll be back in a little bit. All right, guys. This is um, it's probably gonna end vlog three here. I'm actually running up to the corner store. Um, gonna watch some movies, maybe a little Netflix and chill tonight. Nothing crazy. Um, got a lot of work to do uh, preparing for the Handsome Guy Experience. I just sent a, out a final uh, newsletter to the uh, Handsome Guy VIPs. Just uh, letting them know that there's only a few more seats left and the Handsome Guy Experience first ever is gonna be sold out, pretty psyched. Um, that's December 11th through 13th here in sunny St. Petersburg, Florida. But uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Got a lot of cool stuff there. Showed you guys finally how I tie my van skate highs. I hope that answers that question for everybody that wanted to know and that's how I tie all my shoes and I get that question a lot. Um, and that little nugget of wisdom from earlier today, action, take action, money loves speed. Use that shit, people, I'm telling you. Make some money, take action on your ideas, that's how big shit happens. Remember, the internet was just a thought one day, and now I'm talking to you via my iPod Touch while driving a car, which is then gonna edit from it and then upload it to YouTube. That is because somebody said, fuck it, I wanna make some cool shit today. And they did. So, um, yeah. All right, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed a little clip from the cigar bar. Um, I smoked a Regis cigar, which is a, um, a new brand that I've been really liking a lot lately. So, uh, yeah. Feel free to send some to me. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Um, give the vlog a thumbs up. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. Peace.